So what did you do for New Year, incidentally? Well, I met- I cocked it up a bit. Right. You're joking. Oh, You're joking. Go. You're joking, mate. Go on. I went and uh, booked Did a table. You got the wrong day. No, I <laughs> B- booked a table at a restaurant that was shut. <laughs> right. What? I booked a, a table at a restaurant, and the one that I called, it wasn't the one. The call had been diverted. So Suzanne said, "Call them up and see what they're serving." Right. Because I forgot to do that when I booked the table. Right. <laughs> That's not great anyway. So I co- because the thing is, right, it's a restaurant in Covent Garden. But they've got one in Victoria. But when they answered and they said, no, 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 Victoria, I thought that was the person who was answering the phone. Do you know how some people say the name? Right. Right? So then when I called them up and said, what you are you thought, You thought he sounded a bit funny. Right? <laughs> so, uh... I'm confused, Carl, but probably not more. <laughs> it, it was a, bra- than you okay, the, it was a branch of a, um... All right, all right, uh, all right, you, you want to give the restaurant away. So he phoned it up, there's one in Common Garden, they answered the so phone. So it's not, the restaurant's not called no, 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 no. No, no, they, they are, they, they said, no, 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 Victoria. Why can't we get <laughs> the restaurant? I don't know why. <laughs> are we it's scared? not libelous. Are we scared that, like, are you scared people are gonna sort of see you in there, cos it's your regular home? No, it's just like, you know, you gotta pay for stuff, haven't you? Right. I mean, it's... Okay, anyway, so you've I got- I you... mentioned it before New Year, but it's not- So did you go all the way to it? the restaurant to find out that it was closed? No, no, no. What happened is I called- Was that the name of the restaurant again? <laughs> 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 right. The restaurant's called Christopher's. They've got one in Covent Garden, they've got one in Victoria. Right. He phoned up, he went to book, it's a lovely restaurant, I've been there often, I recommend it to him. He phones up, says, can I have a table for new, uh, new, he said, no problem, sir. Right? And then, uh, so I said, oh, you better call up, see if they'd, see if they've got any haddock on the, <laughs> Uh, menu, and he went, hello, and they went, hello, uh, Christopher's. Victoria went, Victoria? They went, yeah, he went, oh, no. That's it, innit? So then, uh, I just said, no, forget it, I'm not going all the way over there. Right. So I cancelled it, right? So, <coughs> when I called up Suzanne and said, look, I made an error. Uh, yes. The place we were going to is shut. Was she so, surprised again, or? So we're not going, <laughs> so she said, oh, try some other places, and I did, they were all booked up, yeah. right? I was fed up anyway, I ate New Year, it's always like this, innit? So, <laughs> So, uh, I said, look, you know the common factor in all these stories. You <laughs> hate Christmas. You hate Christmas. You, you hate New Year. It is you. Right. Yeah. So I said I'll sort something out. Yeah. So I went to Tesco. Leave it with me. Went to Tesco's. Booth went was to shut. Tesco. Yeah. Got, a, got a lovely plate of condoms. Did you just stay in and play with the, her birthday? Her Christmas <laughs> <laughs> Blowing them up. Yeah. Yeah. Balloon, I've done, look, look, I've done some balloons. <laughs> well, it, it was. I think we did stay in, and I watched uh, that thing that you know under greatest moments, which was annoying me. Did you see? Um, there was a nudist on it. You know how I feel about them. Mm, yeah. Right? Um, did you man, see him? Man with two knobs. There was a man with two knobs on it, and uh, a nudist who uh, just like wanders about the house. But it said, it said, uh, and when he visits people, uh, they, I was thinking, who go lets him visit? I go, exactly. Yeah. But he must go there with trousers on and go, hello, lovely to see you. Can I just pop all these off? Well, <laughs> oh, not really, no. And I tell you what, what annoyed me the most, he had a white sofa. If you were a nudist, you'd get you'd get a darker one. <laughs> right? So anyway, right? So we ended up watching that. That annoyed me. And then um, I was tired by about eleven, and I said, "Oh, let's go to bed." And she said, "You can't." And that annoys me—the fact that because it's New Year, you got to stay up. And it's like, "Well, why can't we just?" They should bring it forward, so in case you want to quarter to ten. Quarter to ten. <laughs> well, you say, yeah, well, you stay up, and it's like my eyes were dead heavy, and I was like, oh, "I want to go to sleep." So just stay up, and then it's midnight, and you go up in New Year, then you go to bed. Yeah. Well, not everyone, Carl. Yeah, Some people have a little party. Yeah. Um, so, so it's over with anyway. Uh, so, uh, yeah. So. so are you 86 years old? <laughs> 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 Do you ever enjoy it? You never seem to have any fun, Carl. This is what disappoints. This is what worries me. I feel like you're gonna die. You're here, young, t- you're, right? you're here, Carl. With us two, we've got three. As I was just saying to Steve, three of the greatest comedy minds ever in one room. And Steve pointed out since the goodies. True. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, I mean it should you, be party central. Yeah. yeah.